And tonight's thought comes to you from Inglewood, Colorado, where I'm sitting here in my car getting ready to go in and speak to a group of women. So I want to give a shout out to Faith Young, who invited me to come speak to her private group and has helped me a lot with Facebook marketing and all kinds of things. This woman is so in the know and she has so much love to give. And I'm so excited about speaking for her group, Wealthy Women Empower Wealthy Women. And it's amazing to see what she's doing in faith. I hope that your group goes nationwide because it is something that we as women are ready to step into. And a lot of it actually has to do with the message that I got this week. And so I'm gonna dive right into this message because it is powerful. And what I wanna do tonight is bring you love. Is that okay with you? Can I share some love with you? Because I have got a lot of love to share. My body has been on fire today as excited as I am to share this topic of discussion. So without further ado, the message this week is this. Love flowing through a human being that is sure of his or her divine protection is a powerful force. Therefore, trust this connection within and let love flow. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to let some love flow. And we're going to talk about this connection of trust and what it means to feel divinely protected. Because if we're humans, we know that we've been through experiences where perhaps we didn't feel so protected. Or maybe you're in a space right now where you don't feel so protected but the truth is no matter what experience we've gone into it's always the meaning that we attach to the experience so no matter what outside circumstances we're in no matter how we feel about ourselves no matter what's going on in our mind trust is something that happens with the divine with God first then within ourselves and then out to others very similar to love and I feel those two are hand in hand and so the reason why I want to share some love with you today is because I've spent a lifetime understanding and wanting to understand more about trust in relationships one of my goals is to become a leading expert in the area of trust and what intuition is and I saw a connection between our sexuality and our intuition, a woman's intuition. And this is where I get really fired up. So when I hear the word trust, and a word trust comes through one of my messages, and it's all about being sure of our divine protection, then heck yes, I'm going to go ahead and share it. And I'm going to give you an opportunity that if you're in a place in your life where you're not trusting yourself, where you're not trusting your relationships, where you're saying words like, I don't trust men or I don't trust women. I've been there and I know what that feels like. And it has nothing to do with the other individual has nothing to do with outside circumstances, it has nothing to do with how much money is in our bank accounts. It has everything to do with how much trust we put in our divine protection, in God's protection. If we really believe it, the way we know is through our action. And that's where I was called forth this week. It was like, where Am, am I, is this showing up in my life? If I really believe this is true, and so many people loved this message and shared this message and felt the truth of this message, yet if we really believe it's true, the way it's going to show up is in our actions. That's how we display our truth. That's how we display what it is we really believe in. So if we believe that we are divinely protected in order to share our gifts and talents, in order to step in to that greatest part of ourselves, then we are in a position where we are trusting something greater than ourselves, right? And then allowing that trust to flow through us. And it is to me, it's a very visceral feeling. It's me vibrating like I have been all day long. And I hope you're feeling the truth of that because I believe it's a literal connection with our bodies 
and our soul, that greater aspect of ourselves that is already present with God, with the divine, already in a space of protection. And if we can believe that, then we can speak that and we can live that through our actions. So I want to add some love to this. I can tell within four minutes where a person is stuck in their lives, be it in making money, be it in relationships, be it in whatever it is and where you might have issues around trust. If you give me four minutes of your time, I can pinpoint exactly where it came about and I can promise you it was some type of wounding to your sexuality because it's the core of who we are as human beings. And what I've recognized in my work with students and, and just these programs that I've developed and the coaching that I do is that if we don't get to these core wounds and start healing them and taking different action steps in our lives, we are going to continue to believe that we are wounded and that we can't trust others and that we can't trust ourselves and therefore we can't trust God. There's no sense to that. When the truth is when we trust God, we can then trust ourselves, which allows us to trust others. And I wanna go deeper into that. So I've opened up some time slots and I've gone ahead and put a link into this video into this comment above and below and you can go ahead and click on it and there's time slots that I have open and I would love to connect the dots for you and give you some solutions if that's something that you struggle with. This is the love that is pouring through me. My gifts and talents, my purpose, my passion is for women to trust their intuition. And so if this is resonating with you on any level, click that button and let me share some love with you. And thank you for letting me share some love. And I can't wait to go in and share some love with these women. Faith Young, thank you for this opportunity. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in. And I look forward to sharing our next Thursday Night Thought together.